In 1867, Henri Nestle, a German pharmacist, envisioned a company that would develop food products that provide nourishment and promote well-being. He invented Farine Lacté Nestle, and soon after, Henri founded a company that bears his name. Today, more than a century later, the spirit of Nestle lives on. A spirit characterized by a commitment to human needs, a respect for basic human values, a personalized way of dealing with people, a strong work ethic, a more pragmatic, realistic approach toward business, integrity, honesty, and quality. These comprise the Nestle culture, a value system deeply rooted in its Swiss heritage and its long history of success. We are in an excellent competitive position as the world's leading food company. And I can assure you that we are not going to give this formidable heritage away easily. We will build on it, we will strengthen it. Keeping the essentials, we have to strive for superiority in whatever we are doing, so that we are not only comparable with our rivals and the competitors, but we must outperform them in order to stay ahead. Today, these values, embodied in the basic Nestle management and leadership principles, provide continuity and serve to guide everyone in the Nestle family. Nestle is more people and product oriented rather than systems oriented. Systems are necessary and useful, but never an end in themselves. The basic management and leadership principles of Nestle are anchored on two important concepts. People are the most valuable resource of the company. The company aims to provide a response to human needs all over the world through quality products. To be able to produce quality products that meet people's needs all over the world, Nestle instituted the following principles and continues to live by these values. The Nestle commitment to quality products and brands. From the very beginning, product quality, innovative capacity, and strong brands have been top priority with the company. This commitment to high quality has propelled Nestle to the premier status it enjoys today as the world food company. At Nestle, quality is a way of life. The Nestle principle of decentralization Nestle managers are empowered to make decisions that are better suited to local conditions while being consistent with the global strategy. While Nestle believes in global thinking and strategies, it believes in local action and commitment. For example, while the brand name of the product is global, the taste and type of products are all local. In the increasingly competitive marketplace, management provides wide elbow room for flexibility and speed. When in doubt as to what should be done at the top and what should be done lower down the line, the Nestle response is to do it at the lower level. The Nestle Principle of Flat Organizations Tall organizations or those with many layers of management make communications difficult. Flat structures encourage networking, project teams and task forces, and horizontal communications. Nestle has a preference for simple corporate structures with fewer hierarchies, in other words, flat organizations. Simple structures make communication easier, means more collaboration between project teams, better coordination, faster decisions. All these contribute to more effective ways of achieving shared goals. The four strategic pillars to achieve worldwide sustainable competitiveness are, first, low-cost, highly efficient operations, second, renovation and innovation, third, product availability, whenever, wherever, however, and fourth, consumer communication. The Nestle Principle of Responsibility 
Nestle believes in a team with a leader, rather than a team as the leader. Clear levels of responsibility are defined within the company. At every level of the organization, there must be a clearly designated top. This prevents passing of problems up and down the system and all other unproductive activities that lead to inefficiency. Altogether, the Nestle principles have one common objective, to ensure that Nestle produces high quality products that meet the needs of people all over the world. The Nestle Principle of Continuous Improvement At Nestle, change is a continuous process, innovation, renovation. There is always a better way mentality pervade the organization from top to bottom. Talking about renovation and innovation, let me make two basic underlying statements here. The first one is that the success of leading brands is proportional to its capacity for renovation and innovation. That development will be even more evident in the future. The second is that the required steady, significant real internal growth can only be achieved if we do a little bit more than meeting our today's consumers' demand. Change is evolutionary rather than revolutionary taking care that these changes remain true to the fundamental goals of the company. Nestle values its people, consumers, shareholders, managers, all the people who work with the company, including their families. As such, the company has instituted values that focus on developing, protecting, and conserving this most important resource. For example, Training of employees at various levels in the organization is given top priority by the company. The Nestle commitment to its shareholders. Nestle is committed to create value for its shareholders. It believes in long-term successful business development over short-term profit strategies. It maintains a satisfactory level of profits that puts the company in a better position to think about and act on long-term prospects. Nestle believes that long-term thinking is only possible when the company is not fighting for short-term survival. The Nestle value of respect for other cultures and traditions. Ask the World Food Company Nestle has a deep respect for other cultures and traditions. Nestle accepts cultural and social diversity and does not discriminate on race, religion, or any other basis. Always aware that food products need to be closely linked to local eating and social habits, the company believes in integrating itself and becoming part of the community by adopting the culture and tradition of the country where it operates. Are we close, focused, and attractive enough to our consumer? We have to move from being a consumer-driven company to a company that thrives again the consumer. The Nestle concept of people involvement. Nestle strongly believes in people, in what they know and what they can do. The company acknowledges the need of employees to make a contribution and to take part in the decision-making process. That is why Nestle cultivates open communication lines, top to bottom and sideways. Everyone is encouraged to contribute ideas. This motivates the staff, creates more job satisfaction, contributes to personal growth, and in turn leads to the growth of the company. Nestle is committed to the continuous development of its people to prepare them for the highly competitive scenario. At the same time, is conscious of selecting the right people who can be trained to manage. The Nestle concept of value-added leadership. A position in the Nestle structure exists because of the value it adds to the organization. 
Nestle defines value adding as adding new perspectives to work, bringing in new ideas, making subordinates learn new things, asking thought-provoking what-if questions, creating a culture of doing something better. The qualities of the Nestle manager. Nestle considers the selection of its managers crucial to its long-term and continued success. Aside from the basic criteria of good education, responsible attitude, and sound health, Nestle looks for the following qualities among its managers. Courage, solid nerves and composure, the capacity to handle stress, open-mindedness, being open to new learning, new developments, being well-informed and perceptive, having broad interests, ability to communicate, motivate, develop people, ability to create a climate of innovation by proper delegation, allowing for mistakes, stimulating change through coaching and encouragement. Thinking in context, the ability to see the parts in relation to the whole, to analyze data and make conclusions among others. Credibility, a person who has integrity in word and deed. In other words, practice what you preach. Willingness to accept change and the ability to manage change. And lastly, international experience and understanding of other cultures. A lot has been achieved over the past years, but much more needs to be done if we want to uphold our ambition to be the leading food company, we must constantly challenge ourselves to ensure that in today's and tomorrow's trade environment, our products do reach the consumer all over the places and all over the world, wherever, whenever, and however they need and hopefully want them. Indeed, Nestle is all about people working with people. To provide good food and a good life for people everywhere every single day.